And then our newest product, which is absolutely outstanding, that's the design online tool. And this tool essentially allows you uh, to click on a lead. Let's say you're on our marketing program. You click on a lead, click on the design tool. Is the address correct? Yes. Open it on up. And then you can actually design a project for a customer start to finish using this tool. Price it out in one click and then generate the order with one more click. So in this case, you can see I've obviously skipped ahead a bit, but I've custom designed a wall that it represents a customer's house. And then I've placed on it what is a standard frame Moderna. Want to change this up? Okay, no problem. So I just go into product details here and I can go, okay, this should be a Classico. I can change all of the details of this product with just a couple of clicks. When I want to price this product out, that's just one more click. So I'm going to change my post and beam options here. And so you can really design a product to suit your customer's taste in front of them, just like I'm designing it in front of you. Now, the real beauty here is you want to see how much this kit's going to cost you. Great. Hit this preview quote button. Now, there's also a calculator on the back end that allows our dealers to set their own margins, their own labor values, their own shipping and creating costs, all of the variable fields. And then that'll actually display a retail number to the customer. Um, so all of the errors that are born in the sales cycle where you uh, have your salesman forget something and that throws the price of the project off by two or three thousand bucks. And then when the materials are being ordered, you know, there's a little mistake there. And then you're discussing with the engineer and there's a little mistake there. And all those little mistakes compound and they create problems on jobs. So what this tool really does is allow you to eliminate all those little mistakes as much as possible anyway. Um, and do all of this digitally on your own. So the process is you're sitting down with a customer, you get the project to where you want it to be, the house is correct, the attachment methods are correct, the deck type is correct, and just like this project here, I say, okay, great, I wanna see what this costs. All right, one click, there's the cost. Now remember, this can be a retail price, so you can do this in front of a customer. And then another click generates the order. So you press this button, that order flows through to us. We receive the order, we confirm it with you. Yes, is this actually what you wanna order? Um, and we'll go ahead and place the order for that kit. Now you'll notice that the system here designed this whole project. So this does in a couple of seconds what it would take a draftsman, a CAD draftsman all day to put together. Um, and so this is just the really latest and greatest tool that we've come out with for our dealership. So the mistakes are eliminated a bunch of different ways. Most mistakes in construction are born of communication. So the typical process would be you get out to a home or a salesman gets out to the home, takes a look at the project, measures it up, draws a sketch of what they think it's going to be, and then they put together a price, whether you're using square footage or doing a materials takeoff or whatever those methods are. Uh, then you get back to the office, you take that uh, sales contract and you convert it into an actual materials list. So that process is error prone. And then you convert your materials list into an order with a vendor. There's some error prone um, nature in that as well, because every time a human touches this stuff, it's easy to forget something. The vendor acknowledges it back to you, you confirm it back to them, and ideally a good order is placed. Well, this design tool eliminates all of that back and forth and all of that human touch from it. The only human touch is where, where you're designing the project in the tool. And then from that point on, provided the project is correct in the tool and the, and the inputs that have, the tool has been given are correct, then you press the generate order button and that's a fully automated bill of materials output. Well, ordering typically is a process of creating a list of 50 or 100 items, um, sending that list over by email or even calling it in, and then reviewing what the vendor sends back to you, which is, of course, very error prone and very, very time consuming. Uh, having the ability to generate jobs in three dimensions using the design tool and then just click one button and generate the order, you know, makes this from a multi-hour process into a couple of second process.